guys check out before I start this video, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, stay up to date with all my motherfucking videos. <laughs> Follow me on all my social media, it will be in the description box below. Give the video a thumbs up, it does cause you guys a fucking penny on the channel. Oh, I'd really appreciate it if you hit the thumbs up button. All right, use all my affiliate links in the description box below. Time for the video. Let's get the review. I have no cow. Boom. Boom. Hold on. Boom. Four flavors here. No cow action. No cow. So anyways, long story short, bodybuilding vegan sent me these over, and he's like, hey, man, review these motherfuckers and, uh, and tell me what you think, and if uh, people like it, they can use my coupon code. So, um... AKA the bodybuilding vegan on Instagram. John Thomas is his name. All right. All right. But anyways, coupon code is bodybuilding vegan to get a discount off a of no cow. All right. No cow. I believe that's directly off his website or off, off no cow's website. So the price point is $37 for a box of 12. Then you can use bodybuilding vegan, bodybuilding vegan. We'll get you a discount. All right. I don't get shit for this. All right. Bodybuilding vegan. Anyways, that's the discount code. I don't know if it's 15, 20%. I don't know. It's fucking something. It's better than nothing. I know that much. I know fucking that much, especially with this goddamn economy. All right, let's get to it. No cow, $37. Yay. Um, anyways, 37, coupon code, yada, yada. That's the price point. All right, now let's get into the macros. I got three, I got two dipped and two non-dipped here. All right, now the dipped... All right. Actually, it's, eh, it's pretty similar. 200 calories, all right? Six fat, 27 carbs, 14 fiber, one sugar, seven grams of sugar alcohol, and 20 grams of protein. 20 grams of protein. Some of these vary at one or two grams. No big deal on the fats. One or two grams on the carbs. One or two grams on the fiber. And one or two grams on the protein. The non-dipped have 22 grams of protein, believe it or not, and the, and the dipped only have 20 grams of protein. So that's it. Let's go ahead and try them out. Got four different flavors, key lime pie, cinnamon roll, maple, pumpkin pie. Now, to be honest, I've never liked these bars. I never have, and I probably never will. But maybe they reformulated them, and these are good flavors. I don't know. We'll see. I don't know. I really, really like cinnamon roll. So let's go and try that one first. Then I'll tell you what I think, you know? I'll just tell you what I think. It's what I do. It's what I do over here. I sit in my car, all right? I'm going to tell you what the fuck I think. I know I'm not prepared. All right. Dipped action. Look at that. It looks dipped to me. Yay. 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 Cinema action. Here we go. Cinnamon roll. It's a decent flavor. Some coating action inside. Some cinnamon action. A little bit on the chalky side. A little bit on the... A um, little bit on the gritty chalkiness side. It's not, um, not bad. I could fuck with it. I could fuck with that. By the way, I'm getting antsy because I just took pre-workout. And I still have a 20-minute ride to the gym. Probably was a bad idea. Especially because I drank it before I started this review. And this review is going to take at least five minutes. All right. Key lime pie action. Yay. Some dipped action. Same thing, nice coating. Pretty, pretty okay. Key lime taste. A little bit of chalkiness. A little bit of pastiness. Chalkiness, pastiness, grittiness. Not bad flavor. I'm not really a key lime guy, especially when it comes to protein bars. But um, it's okay. Not a choice. Not a not a flavor I would 
Not a flavor I would resonate to very often. You know what I mean? My ears are like on fire right now. Holy shit. Pre-workout. All right. This is maple. I smell the maple from here. Super soft. Same texture, grittiness, chalkiness. They all have a similar base. And the flavor is just kind of like secondary. Now that being said, it's not it's not amazing. It's not god awful, but it ain't it ain't that good. I don't know. I, would, I just would rather have so many bars over these. Now, I get it. If you're vegan, you're trying to struggle to find a good bar. But honestly, I've had a lot of vegan bars that are pretty good. They usually are far in between, though. It's not very often you get a good tasting vegan bar. This one, pumpkin. I'm not down with this one. This one tastes like tastes like I'm fucking eating potpourri. Too spicy, too festive, too much fucking nutmeg or some shit. The fuck's this thing got in here? It's just natural flavor. It doesn't tell you what. Not a fan of this one. Not a fan. Not a fan. This one I'm going to give like a six. Not a fan. Ratings. Ready? Six. Not a fan. Six. Maple one. 6.75. Key lime. 6.75. Just not a fan. Cinnamon roll. I fuck with this one. 7.5 on this one. I can fuck with this one. It's about the only one that's decent. These other ones, just not not my cup of tea. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. It's just my thoughts. I'm just not a fan of them. So anyways, that's my thoughts. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Subscribe. All that good shit. If you guys are trying these out, let me know what the fuck you think in the comment section below. Thanks, Bodybuilding Vegan, for sending it over and giving me the opportunity to review it on my channel. Bodybuilding Vegan uses code. Appreciate it. Other than that, that's all I got for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for the support as always. Let me know what you want to see next. Subscribe, share, all that good shit. It'll be in the description. We're progressing and never regressing and all that. I'll check you guys later. Yeah.